What's up, bros? Adventure Bro back with another episode of the Adventure Bro Fishing Show. And today we are at Texas A&M Galveston fishing for flounder. But we are with the research department, Marine Aquatics, and they're out here tagging. So if we get one, we're going to get to tag it, send it off to get some data collected for research. Let's go. Y'all doing some research down here? Yeah, we're uh, tagging them. Oh, you're Adventure Bro? Oh, yeah, hey. Yeah, yeah. Oh, damn. Nice to, you, nice to meet you. This is Adventure Bro number two. Oh, gotcha. Nice, nice to meet, meet you, man. Yeah, uh, yeah, we're doing a research project uh, right now. We're actually um, just going to get the rest of our stuff, but we're uh, catching pretty much anything over 15. Okay. We're going to uh, keep and we're going to uh, put a little tracking chip Ooh. in it. Um, and then put another tag on the outside and just release them. All right, so if we catch them, give yeah, them. Yeah, um, she's about to come outside. I'm not sure exactly what she was doing. I know the other day we were only strictly doing over 15. Flounder? Yeah, um, okay. so I'm not really sure. But yeah, pretty much if you catch one, be like, hey, do you want it? Yeah. And we'll tag it and release it. And Sweet. Awesome. But, yeah, we'll yeah, do we have that. like 10 satellite uh, hangers in Galveston Bay, and we just track their migrations. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah it's just a stuff. migration so, traction? Mm -hmm, pretty much. Well, that's cool. We'll try and catch some. All righty, man. And thanks for thanks for subscribing to our channel or no checking us out. Are you here for class? Are you a student? Uh, I'm not a student. My friends are students. Okay. Yeah, but I'm gonna help y'all out. Okay. Great. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. It it swallowed it. Just cut the. Oh, arm. it cut it. Yeah. They don't want to bloody bruise up. <laughs> Potato chip. Go, got him. Got him. It's a solid one, too. Oh, wow. Swallowed it. Whoa. And it broke it. Yeah. All right, we're going to bring this guy over and get him tagged up. have small body cavities so we have to like um, make sure we get large enough fish mm, to put in there yeah um, and then this is all my tagging kit I just did like, some, a little minor surgery okay. on their stomach their body cavities so where their like stomachs and everything should be just cut it open pop this in suture it up oh you put it inside uh-huh oh wow all right so for the flounder you I'll hand it to you and you're gonna hold it belly side up you're gonna make okay signs with your hands around the caudal fin, and then this one you're just gonna have it like around the nose, just or around head. the nose. If these are the, so, if this is the gills, you don't want to smush mm -hmm. the gills. You're just yep. gonna, and then if you feel the fish about to flop or twist or something, let me know. That way, you and I don't get sliced Cut. open with the scalpel, and the fish doesn't get stabbed with the scalpel. All right. All right. So I'll grab him and hand him to you. Okay. I don't always like to be picked up, surprisingly. Yeah, I'd imagine they, they wouldn't like that very much. 
But the nice thing about flounder is once you get them on their back, they kind of they kinda, chill out. Yeah, so sometimes it's easier for me to. hard part here mm -hmm. where the muscle and then it's soft here in the belly I start kind of at the soft and go into the hard um, and you know right now I'm just kind of scraping off um, scales yeah. I don't want to just like go in there and stab because just like a, when you perform surgery on humans you don't want to nick any major organs mm -hmm. or arteries or anything crazy like that Okay. And then you just kind of shove it in there. See, you can't really go much smaller yeah. fish wise than that because it's. So I'm going to massage it into there a little better. And then these are just surgical um, sutures. And on the sutures, I go pretty shallow because again, I don't want to suture any internal organs. <laughs> um, I'm just trying to get the skin. Yeah. Come on. <laughs> you got that one yet already? Yeah, I did that one. Alright. We were out here last night. All right, so then one, two, three towards you, and I just grab the tag end. And then one, two, three, oop, try to avoid stabbing you with that. <laughs> Alright, so if you just want to hold him but submerge him in the water so he's got plenty of oxygen going, we're going to pull him onto the top of the cooler. I'm going to take lengths and then we're going to do an external tag. Okay. So if you see any of these mm, okay. Okay. on the fish, there's a phone number to call us and then you just tell us the tag number and that helps like get us more data. Got it. Alright. Yeah, flip, flip them over. Mm-hmm. You tend to get a little excited when you flip them. One, two, three. I have 16 and a half. Yeah. <laughs> Sometimes they don't go in there. Facing this way. Don't do that. Don't do that. Don't you just do want to slide them in, and that works too. Perfect. This tag is in there. Okay. And then we just come to the edge. Pardon me. And uh, flounder don't really like swim away. They just, just kind of float. Float exactly, and then they go straight. Yeah. Straight out. Yeah. Straight to the so bottom. He's off. Yeah. Awesome. Yeah. <laughs> Six, 